Student loans have been a big problem across America. One and a half trillion dollars must be paid back. YSU has found a way to improve the situation. Today I was looking at it, its success with helping reduce the burden. YSU students listening in a new media journalism class. There's plenty to hear from the university as its student loan default rate has been cut in half. It's great for the university. It's also great news for students. The default rate was 20% in 2011 and has steadily declined to less than 12% in five years. Much of the drop has coincided with a directive from President Tressel. Uh, the president's message of attending YSU with little to no debt, every decision that I believe he's made um, has been moving toward that. YSU allows students to pay one bulk rate for 12 to 18 credits. The Penguin Jumpstart program lets incoming freshmen take cheaper classes in the summer. Penguin Tuition Promise freezes tuition for four years, and the university has increased spending for scholarships and awarded more merit-based scholarships. So the more merit-based scholarships we've awarded, you're reducing the amount of money that a student might need to pay tuition and fees with student loans. YSU Selective Admission has also brought in more prepared students who get to graduation where they have an ability to get a job and pay back the loans. Just three years ago, 54% of YSU students were taking out a loan. Now it's around 49%. All student loans were over $60 million last year. Today it's below $57.5 million. And YSU renew scholarships with a three grade point average. Because a, a campus might be offering you more money in scholarships, but they may require 3.5 to renew. Now YSU also works to educate students on fi financial aid awareness by handing out this two-page tip sheet during recruitment. It talks about monitoring your student debt, repayment options, and some default prevention and consequences on this sheet. sheet they handed out during recruitment on campus and also during events like Financial Awareness Week.